up YouTube, it's me Isaac coming to you with another edition of my life. I'm this is actually a movie review for Doctor Sleep. Well, Doctor Sleep is the sequel to one of my favorite movies from I can't remember what year, I think it's like nineteen seventy or whatever. Nineteen eighty. Thanks, Mom. It was um the sequel to uh, the Shining, which is one of my favorite Stephen King books of all time, and I haven't read Dr. Sleep yet, but my sister gave me a paperback copy of it. I can't wait to read it. And in the movie, it's it has old footage from The Shining of when Danny's a little boy riding around the riding around the Overlook Hotel and on his big wheel. And thanks, Mom again and he's um and he sees room 237 which if i ever stay at the overlook which god knows i want to and god no god knows the one thing i want to do at the overlook is go into that um go into that hedge maze that would be really cool to do it's not ah oh, crap that sucks I thought that was real. Boo! But if we do, st if I do ever stay in at the Overlook, which my mom just told me the hedge maze isn't real and that irritates the, well, not irritates, but upsets me a little bit because I really want to do that. And if I do ever stay at the Overlook, the one room I want to stay in is 237 because that's the one room that's seems to be connected to all the paranormal activity in The Shining and Dr. Sleep, which, like I said, Dr. Sleep is an interesting movie in my opinion. It's the sequel to The Shining, and it's one of my favorite movies of 2020 so far. It's My brother took me to go see it went on opening day or close to opening day, and we left the house around 11 a.m., didn't get home till around 4, which was completely weird, although we stopped in, although we stopped in 8, which that took up a little time. But the movie's like two and a half hours long. It's a great movie. It ends with, it ends up where Danny's, where Jack ends up saving Danny from the Overlook after Danny put sets the boiler room on fire, which is a complete turnaround from him trying to kill him in The Shining. Well, this has been a. It's called the Stanley, by the way. It's called the what? Stanley, not the Overlook. Oh, it's the Stanley. It's the Stanley Hotel. What? It's not called the Overlook. I've always thought it was the Overlook Hotel, but my mom just told me it was the Stanley Hotel, which either way, I want to stay there and that would be a very sweet way to spend a birthday or just whatever. That'd be... It's been a dream of mine ever since I watched The Shining with my mom when I was a kid. Well... This has been another movie review. I'm your host, Isaac Rowan. Please like and subscribe. Later, y'all.